Okay, I just wanted to share with you how to create smart worksheets in Google Drive just to lighten the workload but it also gives the children instant feedback. So in Google Drive if you open a Google Sheet and you can use Google Sheets to make nice maths worksheets uh, you could also maybe use this for spellings um, and I'm sure you could think of other ideas as well so just give my sheet a title I've called it one because I'm differentiating the sheet and what I can do I can either type in the question or I can take a snip from in this case maths no problem of the particular question that I want to set so if I copy and paste that snip into the sheet line it up so that the numbers align with the cell where I want the answer to go and there's my cell where I want the answer so if I put a box around it so the children know where I want the answer to go just squeeze this up a little bit and then what I do is I type in the answer and I can colour code the answer using the menu here conditional formatting so I've right clicked on the cell opened up conditional formatting and I'm going to set a rule whereby the number needs to be equal to so in value or formula I put my answer and then in line with our marking policy I'm going to make the box green if that answer is equal to 1011 but then I can add another rule and this time I'm looking for is not equal to keep the number in but this time I'm making the cell red so the children will know that if the cell turns green the answer is correct if it is red the answer is either missing or it's incorrect and you could maybe put that little note on your spreadsheet so the children are aware and it gives them that instant feedback which is fantastic here's an example of a worksheet I did earlier in true blue Peter style so if I put my answers in you can see it's turning green so it's right uh, this problem here let me see oh dear it's not right so again great example there of how the children can see oh I need to check that it's not correct and they can go back check the sum again oh yes I made that mistake it's now correct <clears throat> and what I did with this sheet once I've made it because this remember is worksheet one I can make a copy of the sheet and then uh, add to that sheet so that I am um, adding more questions or making the questions more difficult and that is the differentiation um, remember if you do change a question you're going to have to change the conditional format rule uh, so here we go this is a, another example of a sheet that I've done and you can see I've pasted in images just to make the sheet look a little bit more interesting <laughs> 